I'm Drew Patrick. And I'm Chase Crow. And this is Franklin, Franklin and, Five. and Five. On Thursday. Thursday. Pancake Breakfast, benefiting the wrestling team, will be on Sunday, November 4th from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. at Chili's on Columbia Avenue. The breakfast will include pancakes, sausage, bacon, juice, or coffee. Credit recovery has started. It will be available on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday from 3 to 4.30. See your counselor to sign up. Yearbooks are now available to order online at yearbookordercenter.com. Price through November 30th is now $90. Please make sure you keep your receipt. Picture proof and IDs are in the front office. No one will be allowed to park at the former Columbia State site. I'm going to ask as many people as I can in a minute what they dressed as for Halloween. Let's go. Hey, Will, what did you dress as for Halloween this year? I dressed up as Dwight Schrute from The Office. Oh, what about you? I dressed up as uh, a thing. What do you guys dress as for Halloween this year? Santa Claus. Power Ranger. Hey, what do you dress as for Halloween this year? Um, I dressed as nothing. Here we go. What do you dress as for Halloween? Myself. What do you guys dress as for Halloween? What do you guys dress as for Halloween? An alien. <laughs> what do you guys dress as for Halloween? Uh, Sandy from Greece. What'd you dress as for Halloween this year? Uh, this year I went as a magician, so I got the top hat, a cape, and some cards, and just like went around and did a little magic for everyone. All right, there you have it, folks. See you later. You must complete the follow-up survey for Senior Shadow Day by November 2nd to be counted present at school. Lunch today is chicken quesadilla, beef nachos, beef soft tacos, Spanish rice, black beans, and corn. Newly formed equestrian club. This club is open to anyone. You don't have to have any experience with horses or ride in a specific discipline to be in it. Our first meeting is Thursday, November 2nd from 3 to 345 in Miss Swift's room. Room 800. Service hours are available at the FHS Mistletoe Market on November 10th through 11th. Contact Pam Harden at this link. Congratulations to our girls and boys cross country teams. Both advanced to the TSSAA state meet. They will complete, compete on Saturday at Steeplechase Park. soccer team finished their season with an overtime loss to the Collierville in the state tournament. Thanks ladies for the great season. The MVP race, one that I consider a little more important. It seems to be a very tight race to the end. I mean you got guys like Kawhi Leonard, LeBron James, even Russell Westbrook the defending MVP all vying for the position but I've got to go with the Greek Freak Giannis Antetokounmpo to win it because, well, he just doesn't have that much help and the East is very weak allowing the Bucks to potentially get a top three seed and if they do and Giannis gets great stats consistently, I see him winning the MVP and I really see all that happening. So he's going to win the MVP. If the Warriors make the finals, they've still got LeBron and company to deal with. Iguodala to Curry, back to Iguodala, up for the layup, oh, blocked by James! Then LeBron coming off a loss in the finals, you want to face that? I didn't think so, especially with all the depth they have. I mean, you go too deep at point guard with Isaiah Thomas and Derrick Rose. Then at shooting guard, you got Dwayne Wade and J.R. Smith. LeBron James, of course, manning the helm at small forward. Then you get Jay Crowder at power forward and then Kevin Love as a small center with Tristan Thompson backing him up so 
the Warriors will not win the NBA Finals this year because they'll just be complacent. I've got another thing. Stop blaming Lonzo's performance on LeVar Ball. When he doesn't play good, it's not because LeVar Ball said he was the best player. It's because he just flat out wasn't as talented as the other guy. LeVar Ball's done nothing but good for him. And if you want him to shut up, well, that's about as likely as Tennessee scoring a touchdown in the month of October. This has been Franklin and Five.